I've, I've got to ask Mr. Flash Henson here. So you went to Kaiser, right? You grew up I did. sort of in yeah, that Yeah, Hawaii in Kai hood. is my hood, absolutely. All right. Um, what do you love most about about Hawaii Kai? Uh, these days, I'm a, I'm a huge Cocoa Head fanatic. I, lo I love uh, hiking up Cocoa Head, uh, doing that trail. But I've just, Hawaii Kai has just kind of always had like a really kind of good feel to it and it's definitely different from town um yeah. my parents uh just recently moved out of portlock um into kahala so i would spend a lot of time at my parents house in portlock which is obviously amazing china yes, walls yes. i mean there, there's a lot of really cool things about hawaii Kai. yeah well you know what mckenna maduli is there this morning she is live at sea she's touring the coast and experiencing the good life she's talking with one of location's neighborhood experts about hawaii Kai's marina lifestyle mckenna how you doing out there <gasps> Aloha, Trini and Flash. Yes, it is the lifestyle. It is so nice. And I am here with our locations resident expert, and she's probably going to be my new BFF because she's so <laughs> awesome, Miss Joe Frazier. Thank you, Joe. Now, we're on the marina right now. Tell me what is so attractive about this marina lifestyle. Residents really love an, um, a marina oriented lifestyle. Many of them quest to be able to live on the water. And when they go over to friends' homes and they see that they can get in a boat, drive to dinner, drive to the grocery stores, go kayaking, paddling, canoeing, and even take the boat out and catch fresh fish to bring home for dinner. It's pretty special. I mean, yes, it's very, very special. Let's talk about the median prices here for an oceanfront home. What are those numbers like? Um, being on the marina, we actually have um, the single family homes are running a median price of 1.5 million approximately. Mm -hmm. And uh, our condos and townhouses run approximately 850 on the median. Um, and of course, that varies. That varies a lot in terms of the conditions, the improvements, the lot sizes, the water frontage, and uh, having a boat dock, not having a boat dock. It's, it's you know, this is, this is what you quest for. And if you've ever been at a waterfront home in the marina, you'll see why they love it here. I'm completely obsessed. You know, these are great key highlights right now. Let's talk about some of the other things around. You know, Flash was just talking about Cocoa Head, but tell me about some other highlights here um, in the marina lifestyle. Well, we have three shopping centers, and all three of them have docks for boats. So you can do your grocery shopping just going from your house to the grocery store and back. Um, we actually have Costco, City Mill, Safeway, Longs. Everything that you'd need is here. There's literally no reason to leave Hawaii Kai, and that's pretty special. We actually have two coffee shops, uh, medical facilities, mm -hmm. um, just everything. I mean, I can't think of a reason. Movie theaters, I can't think of a reason to leave Hawaii Kai. I know, I I'm totally agree. My boyfriend is from Kulio, so I spend a lot of time out here. And really, once you get out here, it's just so nice. Let's talk about a little bit about the dining activities and all the other things that they can do residents here. Yeah, we have Roy's, of course, out back. Um, Asagio's, wonderful Italian restaurant. Shopping. Shopping. Tiny Tons can of appreciate boutique. the shopping. <laughs> yes, lots and lots of little boutique shops, which are really fun. They're really, really fun. You're, you've got local owners and you've got the local residents um, honoring their, their companies that they have here. We love that. Um, the other thing is we're so close to all of the water uh, sports that people would love to do. You're over the hill, you go to Hanama Bay, yeah. Sandy Beach, um, Sea Life Park, and, and literally uh, you can have a guest come and within 10 minutes they can be at all of the top visitor spots without having to be stuck in traffic. It's pretty special. It is pretty special. And look at that. We're just approaching all of this great dining and activity area right here in Hawaii. Kind of. Where can people find more information about these homes? Well, you can go to locations.com and basically pull up anything and everything you'd like to know or of course call your um, real estate agent and hopefully that's a location and locations hawaii.com yes wow wonderful joe frazier you're amazing you really are our neighborhood expert here in hawaii kai it has been a gorgeous morning over here now i'm going to send it back to flash and trini in the studio you guys want to be on this boat come over? <laughs> <laughs> i want to be on that boat look at that the weather's beautiful the water is calm that's a great day at work that's hawaii kai for you <laughs> yeah i'm very jealous of mckenna right now yes i didn't <laughs> realize I knew that one of the shopping centers had the dock because I've I have grown you know I have friends that live on that side and they just take their little boat and they stop off at cha-cha-cha's have a drink um, I didn't realize they all have they all have it yeah 
It's it's criminally underutilized too. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I'm imagining shopping at Costco and then just putting your right? your <laughs> groceries in the boat. I think for people that don't live in Hawaii or who have never been here, I think like all those types of homes is exactly what people would imagine it would be like yeah. to live here. <laughs> no, I remember visiting a friend who lives on the marina, and I walked in, and it's just you just. It's peaceful, right? Oh, yeah. Just removing all that stress. All right, thank you, Flash. Coming up 